Each ascendant beacon you reawaken reclaims a road once lost to me, broadens my sight, but my realm still aches. Savathun has done so much to destroy everything my people worked for. She stole my brother from me, twisted his mind, and delivered him to his executioners. Then she had the audacity to steal him from the Traveler, manipulate him, and lead him back home. It is strange, having him here. And yet not. Fro is a wounded bird, flinching away from me. So much like Aldrin, but lost without a guiding hand. Do you understand why I forbade him from speaking with Savathun? I do. This reunion is such cruel kindness. I will find a way to repay her for it. And you will continue to bring me the Techians I need to do so. Will do, my queen. I will do. Good old exotic quest. Alright, we're gonna have a new dialogue. About this. Far off kingdoms, queens, witches, mystic adventures among the stars. Remember, Crow? They were only stories. It passed the time. You wrote them down like in a book. I always kept the pages on you so Spider wouldn't find them. Glint, enough. My brother was a storyteller too. He spun the most fabulous fables for our people's children. I have copies in my library, if you like. That won't be necessary. Well done. We've detected the Lost Techian's location through the Beacon Network. Bring her home. On this latest expedition, Zivu Arath's forces appear to have gathered their strength. Zivu Arath's title as the Hive God of War is no mere gilding. She earned it. She is a strategist and tactician. Her sister may be known for her cunning, but there is more at work here than a sword's edge. I've been thinking about family quite a bit. What with all the spare time I have. It might surprise you to hear, but everything my siblings and I have done has been for each other. Even though the Vanguard isn't quite the same, they're no different at heart. You'd do anything for your family, chosen or otherwise. Go to any lengths to avenge them. Look at the Crow and Queen Mara. Siblings. Bonded by cosmic fate. Forever orbiting one another like binary stars. Mara reminds me of my sister. She's afraid. Holding on so tightly because she can't bear to lose one more thing. But we all have to let go. When I am separated from my worm, I'll be separated from Zivu Arath, too. And then my sister will be alone. The last of us. But as much as I care for her, I cannot stay like this. Alright, everybody. That does it for another Destiny 2 video, Season of the Lost. This is week 4. We have the opening chat from Marasov. And then we go into some of the astral alignment. We get a little bit more from Crow and Glint. And then uh, a bit of information after we save the last Tekion and the latest um, Shattered Realm in the Forest of Echoes. And the updated Forest of Echoes where you can actually get some more stuff now. Uh, so do be sure to check that out. And then finally we hear from the Queen of Lies once again, Savathun herself. So... I hope you guys do enjoy the video. If you did, it'd be absolutely wonderful to hit the like button and do consider subscribing to the channel. But until next time, hope you guys have an absolutely wonderful day. And as always, stay hydrated, as hydration is key.